Hey folks, Andy, Head Hard Head Smith coming to you live. Well, live while we're recording anyways. It's day number 22 of the 31 days of geocaching. I am by a busy, busy road looking for a guardrail cache. We had to go for parking grabs. We're starting to run out of places to find geocaches, even in a highly saturated area. So I'm having to drive farther and farther from work on my lunch hour. So parking grabs are a savior when it comes to when you're doing a streak. And that's what we're doing. Let's see if we can find it. All right, doing a guardrail cache. And this one was actually kind of interesting. The clue brings you somewhere around this area. In guardrail caches, you always have to be careful, of course, of spiders. We've already recorded a black widow earlier in the month. You butt things like this, you got to check underneath, down, around, under here, here. Actually, even bolt caches like this can be in place and the holes in the behind the uh, the eye beams themselves. So you got to really look everywhere, which is what I'm doing. And in this particular case, I found one clue that told me where the geocache is. Let's see if you can spot it. Let's see. Nope, not there. How about, check this out. Bison tube. So I'm going to take this little guy, I'm going to uh, sign the log, put it back in his hidey hole, go get me some lunch while I still have time. But hey, why don't we go now and see how Miss Amy's doing for her 22nd geocache of the 31 days of geocaching. Wow, they are all starting to blend, aren't they? Let's go see what she's up to now. Hey folks, Andy Headhart Hatchsmith here with the Headhart Hatchress. It is day number 22 of the 31 days of geocaching. And we're kind of in an unusual spot here. That's why we've got this weird view. And uh, as you can tell, we're near an electrical tower. Uh, no, not in a dangerous way. It's just that's where the big lines go through. Anyways, we're looking for a park and grab. Uh, we're going to see if Miss Amy can find it. And uh, we're going to go from there. Let's see what happens. All right. We are near a really cool tower. And they are looking around. Okay, that one's kind of unusual. What's that one look like? Ah, the International G. Very cool. Nats. Nats? That's beautiful. Yeah, there do seem to be a lot of bugs. Actually, a lot of them. Yeah. They're all around the camera. Okay. It's bugs! There are an unusual amount of ants here. That's because I love her. All right. <laughs> We're trying to talk without yeah. having bugs come out our nose. It's really kind of an interesting little situation. Lots of gnats. Anyways, this is Andy Headhart Hat Smith with the Headhart Hattress. That's uh, number 22 of 31 of the 31 days of geocaching. Thank you so much. I just got a bug in my ear. That is loads of fun. Yeah, okay, so. This one that landed on the camera. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. All righty. So, we're going to get out of here. Gonna wrap it up. We're going to wrap this puppy and go on. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching the vlog. And uh, and we will go from there. <laughs> this is professional people. <laughs> I just swallowed a bug. All right. We'll see you later. Uh, be safe out there. Quit shaking the camera. And uh, we'll see you tomorrow for number 23. Ah! We gotta get out of here. Blah!
use for different things. And I'm here, and you're here, and Dave's here. We're all here. <laughs> Welcome to the Geo Snippets Reboot Podcast. All I can say is check everything. Don't take anything for granted when you go geocaching because you never know 